What's the story on Montero Luna? That call we got from Wagoner Farm turned out to be a little more interesting than I was expecting. Some men were trying to run the Wagoners off the land. They tried to buy it first, but when that didn't work, they turned to threats. We confronted them, and unfortunately, it came to violence. None of them survived. You helped someone in need and came back alive. That's a job well done. For the time being, yes, but you could still be in danger. That's why we need to fill in some blanks. What did you make of these men who were trying to take the farm? If that's true, then someone must have hired them. Now, did you find anything that might give us a lead on why these men wanted the farm? All right. Hmm. Says here the thief had help from someone inside Hope Tech. There ain't much to go on. There's something else. They were dressed in Free Star militia uniforms. The unit badge was yellow on black with the number one. Didn't you fight in the Colony War, Marshal? That sound familiar at all? The 1st Cavalry. I was in that unit for a while. But it was disbanded decades ago. After the Battle of Nera. What was left of it, anyway. No, it doesn't. Just raises more questions. It's a good bet that Starship Thief can help us get some answers. The Hope Tech factory is in Hope Town on Polvo. Nia Kalu's our ranger stationed out there. She can introduce you to Ron Hope, the president of Hope Tech. He might be able to help you find the thief. Just make sure you stay on his good side. He's on the Council of Governors, and they're the ones we answer to. Good. The last thing I need is the Council breathing down my neck. This is your assignment now, Deputy. Work with the other Rangers. Find out what you can about those men on Montero Luna. Meantime, I'll look into a possible connection with the 1st Cavalry. Good hunting. Mayday! Mayday! This is Free Star Ranger Nia Kalu. If anyone is hearing this, system's failing! Need help! I repeat, need help! Welcome to the Free Star Collective. Please maintain your current course while we scan your ship. All clear to land at Hope Town. We have a clean dock, right on the money. Please tell me you're here to help. Not to try and steal my ship. Welcome aboard, Deputy. Sorry if I can't give you the grand tour just yet. I was tracking a crew of outlaws that's been preying on merchant ships. Bastards got the drop on me. I ran them off, but they got a few good hits in. As you can see, I ain't in much shape to make repairs. I'll be fine once the pain medication kicks in. The priority right now is the ship. 
Can't do my job without it. Thanks. That should get me home. You're right. They were pretty beat up, so I don't think they got real far. But if they make it back to their hideout, I might never find them again. We can't let that happen. They look to be heading for Polvo's Moon Miatha. Good hunting. I don't want to hear any complaints. Yes, what? Pardon? Keep an eye on your valuables. You made it. Those outlaws didn't give you too much trouble, I trust? I'm sure it didn't hurt that I softened him up for you. You've got good timing. A courier just came in from Aquila. The Marshal sends his regards along with a briefing on your case. I was surprised as hell to learn about the Starship theft. Nobody said a word to me about it. Anyway, Mr. Hope can see us whenever you're ready. If you need to take a little time first, feel free. His office is upstairs. He's in a meeting, but it should be wrapping up. Come on.
Now, now, make two gold. I'm sure you can do better than that. You just need to apply some good old-fashioned creativity. Do you know how I built this company? By not spending a single credit that I didn't have to. I guess I could offer double shifts. It'll push payroll pretty high, but I think it's a worthwhile trade-off. As for parts, we could try outsourcing. Do a contract with scavengers, maybe, but that's a decision that's got to be made upstairs. Hmm. Well, talk to Elaine about the scavengers. It's not a bad idea, provided we get a good deal. And I don't mean a fair deal. I mean a good deal. Remember, it's not just our bottom line that matters. We're also responsible for the welfare of everyone in the factory. We look out for our people here, Burchett. That's a point of great personal pride. Um, excuse me, uh, Mr. Hope? Well now, the Free Star Rangers. At last! <laughs> ah, damn, good to see you. I think we're done here, Burchett. Yes, sir. This is the deputy I told you about. Splendid. Splendid! It's a noble calling, being a Free Star Ranger. Mm, we certainly could use more of you. Let's get down to it, shall we? Time is money. I'm sure I don't have to tell you what an outrage it is to have a ship stolen right out of the factory. <sighs> Justice must be done, and the sooner the better. That's good news. I'll send my people over to bring it home. Of course, that doesn't mean your work is done. I want the thief found and prosecuted to the full extent of the law. I'm sure I don't need to remind you of my position on the Council of Governors. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, Tell me that you've at least got a lead of some kind, hmm? Though what happened after the ship was taken doesn't concern me. What does concern me is making sure that this doesn't happen again. Well, I'm not sure I can be much help, but I'll answer whatever questions I can. Very well. I need you to understand something, Deputy. This town is home to men, women, and children who depend on Hope Tech for a living. I provide jobs that put food on their tables and a roof over their heads. It's a responsibility that I take very seriously. If word gets out about the stolen ship, my investors will lose trust, and my workers will pay the price. I can't allow that. I'm glad we understand one another. I'm sorry to interrupt, Mr. Hope, but there's been a development. Not now, Cosette. I'm in the middle of something. But, sir, we have new information. I've just received a report that the stolen ship was seen landing at Neon just after the theft. A breakthrough at last. Well, Deputy, it sounds like you'll be heading to Neon. <sighs> Which means I can get back to work. Remember what we discussed. My people are depending on you. Hey, can I get a word? That wasn't as helpful as it could have been. Still, at least you know where to pick up the trail. Yeah, me too. So, guess you're headed for Neon. There's a ranger stationed there. Name's Jalen Price. He's a little different than the rest of us. But a Neon's a different kind of place. He should be able to help you out. Well, we've both got work to do. 
It was good to meet you, Deputy. Thanks again for helping me out up there. Yeah, the question of who helped the Starship Thief is still an open one. Don't you worry. I'll keep an ear to the ground. You be careful in Neon. <laughs>